Hello everyone. Before I proceed further, people who would like to know market updates in Hindi, we have uploaded the video on our channel. You may refer the link mentioned in the description box. The Indian benchmark indices fell over half a percent lower today, dragged mainly by sell-off in public sector banks and auto stocks in second half. S&P BSE Sensex ended at 51,942, down 334 points, while Nifty 50 closed the session at 15,635 mark. Let's talk about delivery calls for tomorrow. So HDFC Life Insurance Company, buy range between 679 to 688. Stop loss you can keep at 649. Target you can keep at 780. Talking about Uflex, you can keep the buying range between 459 to 465. Stop loss you can keep at 438. Target you can keep at 505. Delivery calls which was given on 8th of June uh, to buy DLF between 306.60 to 307. Target was supposed to be at 313. Stop loss was at 300. Close the position as stop loss has been triggered. Aditya Birla fashion, buy range uh, supposed to be at 206.80 to 207. Target at 211, stop loss at 203. Target has been already achieved. Let's talk about top gainers and top losers. So power grid up by 3.8% and NTPC up over 1% were the top gainers while LNT, Reliance Industries, Bajaj Finserve and Indescent Bank down over 1% each were the top Sensex Lagards. In the broader market space, the S&P BSE mid cap and small cap indices ended the session 0.71% and 0.95% lower respectively. Individually, shares of Tata Motors hit an over 3 year high of 358.25, up 1.5% on BSE in intraday trade today on the back of heavy volumes. However, the stock erased gains in the second half and ended the session 2.72% lower at 343.25 rupees. All the Nifty sectoral ended today's red, uh, session in the red with Nifty Auto, Nifty PSU Bank and Nifty Reality Indexes falling over 1% each. Global markets, uh, if we talk about the European stocks, traded near record highs on Wednesday, that is today, with investors holding off on taking big bets ahead of a policy decision from the European Central Bank and US inflation reading later this week. Pan-European Stock 600 Index slipped 0.1% in morning trade but stayed just short of a record high of 455.66 hit in the previous session. Other main regional bosses including Germany's JAX and France CAC40 were trading flat. In Asia, the MSCI's broadest index of Asia-Pacific shares outside Japan ticked down 0.15% and Japan's Nikkei average shed 0.25%. Let's talk about currency update. The Indian rupee ended lower at 72.97 per dollar amid selling in the domestic equity market. It opened flat at 72.90 per dollar against QSG's close of 72.88 and traded in the range of 72.88 to 73.02. Let's talk about oil update. So oil prices continued to rally today on signs of strong fuel demand in Western economists while the prospect of Iranian supplies returning faded as the US Secretary of State said sanctions against Tehran were unlikely to be lifted. Brent crude futures were up 32 cents or 0.3% at USD 72.42 a barrel at 09.11 GMT. US West Texas intermediate crude futures climbed 18 cents or 0.3% to USD 70.23 a barrel. For more up important updates, do like, share and subscribe our 5 Paisa channel. Do not forget to click on bell icon to get timely notifications. Any stock market related queries, you can raise in comment box section. Make your investment journey easy and rewarding with 5 Paisa. Thank you.